I'm going to talk about the uh, alley pus from uh, Santa Ana del Rio, Eduardo Hernandez. This is a pretty remote little village. It's tiny. It's got, you know, a number of pop the people in the village are like 200 or something. And, you know, it's Rio, it's the, the village is on a river, but it's very steep. It's, it's, it's back in the mountains. And this, the, around there, this is again at about 5,400 feet, mountainous, uh, white soil. So there's, there's chalk in it, rocky soil. This is, this is a very mineral product. And, um, this guy, when we were uh, shooting a video about how to make artisan mezcal, we were sitting there and talking to him about, and his dad was there. And at one point he said this amazing thing, which was he could tell what was going on inside the still by looking what was coming out. He could look at the stream of mezcal coming out of the bottom of the still and tell where, the, where it was in the distillation process. I've never heard anybody else say that about his product, but I believe it. This is incredibly well made. It, 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 it's very focused. It's um, nicely fruity. It's got a little sweetness to it. It's incredibly well balanced, very clean. As you can tell, this is one of my favorites. It's got this nice vegetal sense in the back of your mouth. Agave is a plant, and this really brings out the beautiful vegetal qualities of the agave.